Malaysia, a truly Asian destination filled with colors, culture, and heritage. It is home to one of Asia's most historically significant locations, the capital of Malacca. It was a melting pot for Western and Eastern cultures since its days as an important trading port in the region. Today, Malacca is a very popular tourist destination. One famous point of interest is Jonker Walk. Every day, Jonker Walk will be visited by many tourists because of the sights, scenes, and food. But beyond its busy facade lies hidden treasures. Within its corners and alleys, Jonka Walk houses time capsules of culture. An array of little known dying traits of the region can be found here in this heritage road. From traditional aluminium kitchenware to handmade baskets, from the traditional praying altars to traditional Chinese signboards. Each of these traits has a long and colorful history stories which are only told by a few and knowledge that is slipping away with time. This is the story of one man, his unique skill and the life behind one of Malaysia's hidden but significant treasures. This is Chan Chok Tiam, the only traditional wooden barrel maker in Malaysia. Passage 哦,怎麼這才,才到來賣,這樣子就這樣子。As a child, Chan was adventurous and curious. His behavior had led him to discover his destiny. 啊,因為我讀書,懶都不讀,看到我父親,就我也是坐在那邊,拿了些桃花,桃花拿來做做做,把這給我學會了,就學會就做到,就做到現在。through the years, Chan's daily routine has made him a very tough man. While most people his age would be too tired to do anything, Chan is a remarkable example of perseverance and passion. Chan's Tong business had been doing relatively well for himself and his family. Back then, during his father's time, tongs were a common item used by most households. After inheriting the business, Chan not only relied on frequent customers but also began to receive wider market prospects. Chan's craftsmanship and high quality products had received attention from several local newspapers and publications, such as 
Sinchu Daily, China Press, Nanyang Xiangbao, and also Heritage Magazines. These parties had taken much interest into Chan and his rare art, and helped to boost his market and reputation to certain extents. In 2008, Malacca Town was recognized as a World Heritage Site by UNESCO. This led to more intensive heritage conservation efforts in the town. Chan and his wooden barrel business also benefited from this recognition with an exponential increase in publicity and attention. Since then, Chan's craft had become more than just a business, but also a treasured art and protected craft. Despite making wooden barrels for many years, Chan has had much difficulty finding people to pass down his unique skills and knowledge to. Besides those challenges, it is curious to wonder what are the ups and downs have this golden citizen faced throughout his experience. Chan is a pleasant old man with little expectations but a big heart. Just like anyone else, this master tongue maker has his very own unique hopes and dreams. We have slowly forgotten the ancient knowledge passed down by our ancestors, our culture and stories from generations before us. Take a step back and think about our heritage that is slowly fading with time.